What I'm supposed to be talking about is that photograph that was sent to me about the, uh, the beer and beet camp in 1913. And the guys that are in the photo are all quartermaster staff. So you think quartermaster, yeah, runs the store, sits, above, sits behind a desk, hands out a shirt when you need one, not much of a job. How wrong? Because this is what the quartermaster was re responsible for, and I'm going to go through it pretty quick because uh, keep it a short video. So paymaster was responsible for all pays, all requisitions which had to be receipted, maintain all ledgers for all equipment and all clothing, all stores in the stores to be kept in good condition and all to be labelled. There will be maintained books and ledgers for charges to troops for deterioration or loss of equipment that must be debited to the individual so as not to be debited to the squadron, to inspect all kit and equipment that is returned and to ensure that any restitution is paid for damaged or war unnecessarily worn equipment, to ensure that all kit is labelled, to issue each person, to ensure each person is explained exactly the condition of the equipment they're given. So if a rifle has a scratch in the butt, that is pointed out to the member and they sign a receipt for that. All issues are receipted. Report to the officer any apparent misuse of equipment. Prepare the daily requisitions for rations for the men, for the horse feed, any fuel needed, all stalls, stores, and ensure dispensed at the correct time. Check the quality of all rations distributed. Make sure all rations are receipted for. The quartermaster staff are responsible that all tents are pitched correctly and are also trenched correctly. Quartermasters are responsible for the correct horse line. They are, the quartermasters are responsible for the correct number and storage of all rakes, shovels, brooms, wheelbarrows, and that they are correctly stacked between stable duties. They will ensure the kitchen, the ru they will ensure kitchen, general rubbish and latrines are maintained clean and neat and disinfected at all times. They will be filled as required. Quartermasters will supervise the cooking of all meals and will ensure that the mess tent orderlies carry out their duties as required. They will ensure that each tent has a notice board on which are posted each person in that tent their duties for the day of the week. So if you ever thought the quartermaster had a cushy job, like you've seen the quartermaster in uh, Kelly's Heroes, for instance, is not like the movies. They were busy blokes. So when you see that photograph, look at those blokes and know that for that camp, that 17-day camp, they were busy, and boy, were they uh, had a lot of responsibilities. So I reckon this is going to be the end of it, as this horse has just behaved so well for uh, three or four videos and a lot of outtakes. Good on you, Cody. You've done a great job. Thank you very much.